Yeah, Miles, um, we do get asked about um, setting up a lead collet die, so I'm going to show you how to do that. This here is a very small portion of the lead product we do. Collet dies, um, crimp dies, taper crimp dies, quick trim dies. But let's not digress, we're going to find a 308 collet die and come over here. Guys, the lead collet die um, from Lee Precision is a fantastic product. It is so cool. It's cool because it's a great neck sizer, but the single coolest fact is it doesn't require any lube, which is a fantastic boon and saves you a lot of time. It also works brass pretty much one, uh, one third the amount all its leading competitors do. Um, there's a few custom dies that will that work similar, but and work the brass the same amount, shall we say. They don't really work similar. Um, anyway, we've got a lead collet die and we get asked about setting it up. Um, it does require reading the instructions. You don't set it up like another die because it's actually actuated by the ram and the shell holder. So you put your ram to the top of its stroke and you press, you wind the die in. until it starts to touch the shell holder. Then you back your ram out and you wind it in about a half turn. You'll see that the ram and shell holder push the bottom or collet section of the die up into the die body. Right, so you start with a case. That one happens to be done already, so we'll start with this one. Put it in the shell holder. It runs up into the die. It ejects the primer that you just saw fall on the floor, we'll have to pick that up later, and then it sized it. Now if we get this die and check it, this case and check it, neck tension is important. Um, sometimes you'll find different manufacturers, it doesn't quite hold the case, the projectile as, as tightly as you want. You can wind that in another quarter of a turn and it will hold that case, that projectile nice and tightly. Um, don't over tax it, don't go winding it in too much because the die is designed to let go or the top nut pop out of it to save you damaging it. You've got a lot of power here in the press. The die is a fantastic die. You can't beat it, it will load you lovely accurate ammunition and it's, as I say, no lubes, a real boon. But read the instructions to set up a lead collet die. There's a couple other little tricks we can tell you if you phone us up and talk to us. Thank you.